it's a catchweight bout between Steve Colzola and Matt Church. There you see the tail of the tape. Both men, 26 years of age, 5'11 to 5'9, 159, 160 for Church, and a two and a half inch reach advantage for Colzola coming out of the red corner. Church is going to come up. Take me to Church. That's his entrance song. Watch. <laughs> and with that, we send it to Jazz Securo for the official introduction. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is brought to you by Autoshopper.com, your new and used car showroom. Three rounds at a World Series of Fighting catch weight of 160 pounds. And now introducing on my left, fighting out of the blue corner. His record sits three victories, only one defeat, two wins coming by way of knockout, one by submission. Standing five feet, nine inches tall, weighing 160 pounds, fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, by way of Denver, Colorado, making his debut in the Decagon, introducing Matt the Sleeper Church. And now his opponent across the deck again brings a perfect record to the cage. Six victories, zero defeats, five wins coming by way of knockout, one by submission. Standing five feet, 11 inches tall, weighing 159 pounds, fighting out of Temecula, California by way of Naperville, Illinois. Also making his debut in the World Series of Fighting, presenting Steve Thunderbeast Cazola! Thunderbeast. Your referee for this fight is Big John McCarthy. So with Big John in charge of the action, we get set for a catchweight bout. Cozola brings the perfect record. And boss, what impressed me about his numbers and stats, all of his fights, he finishes. Yeah, that's what he does. Five knockouts, one submission. What's not to love? Right. He is the modern-day version you of ready? Kenny Florian. I finish fights. And here we go. This one's scheduled for three rounds. Cozola comes out quickly. And you see Church walking him down. Both men making their debut, as Jazz said, in the World Series of Fighting, and a slip right there as Cozola picked the wrong time to lose his footing, but and right Church away. unable to capitalize. Yeah, but you saw he made the 180 there. Very smart. He's back away from the fence right away. Nice combination early from both fighters. Church nice. in the white trunk, Cozola in the black and gray. So in a catchweight bout, boss, at 160, both fighters really in their wheelhouse. Not a major change from what they were planning on. That's good. So they both feel good. You're going to see a stronger fight. Yep. Yo, Cazola has got a nice uh, story. Lived in, in Illinois, moved yep. to California, met this beautiful girl here, and then he lost his job, had to go back to Illinois, didn't want to do it. His friend got him a fight. And he, but he needed to win the fight, and the win bonus right. he needed to win to have. He did that. Good start. Oh, and a straight right oh, catches Church. Church. Cozola with a beautiful straight right down the pipe, and he sends Church to the canvas. And Matt Church is going to have to do some quick recovery right here. Man, that's it. The, the good old one doing another right he popped in there. Big combination, catches him again. Church is completely in survival mode as Cozola sensing an opportunity to end oh. this fight. This could be over. Oh, and he goes down again. And Big John yeah, taking a look. Stop it. He may stop this fight. Early in round number one. That is it. Okay. It is all over. Anyway, he won the fight. He stayed there. That beautiful girl is now his wife and they have a kid. Great story. Man, it started with the one-two. And that's that's what I always say. This has been used in boxing for ages. This is the beginning, but still, a well-placed one to will knock you out. It was the first straight right down Main Street that caught Matt Church, and then Steve Colzola just poured it on. Boss, as you like to say, he let the hands go. <laughs> yeah, he did that. Man, wow. Six knockouts and a submission he has now. I mean, if you're going to make a debut in the World Series of Fighting, can you think of a better way than a start like this in round number one? And you see, he stays calm. He's not getting in uncontrolled, though he got hit that one time. And he's loading up these big body shots. Now, that was a very nice shot to the side of the head. 
Yeah. Now he starts to do the back fists. Watch. To the other side. Now this. And now referee stops it. Yep. Hammer fists. I mean, not back fists. Wow. Quick work by yeah. Steve Colzola. Catch weight 160. That's right. Look at this one more time. The finish comes, and Matt Church just rocked by that straight right. Boom. This is the second part oh, of, of it's, it's coming now. Boom, right boom. there. Beautiful. Very nicely done. That was the first time. And then he connected with the big right. After. And a lot of punches. So Kozola runs his record now to 7 and 0. And all of them coming by way of finish at a first round knockout as Matt Church makes his way over to congratulate Steve Kozola. Church will drop to three and two. We'll give him another opportunity. Looks to be a good fighter. He had some great footwork early on. He just got caught. Boss, you've said many a time in this game, you never know. You really don't. Wow. Steve Kozola with a beautiful straight right, able to end it in round number one on Matt Church as Big John stops it. We set it now inside. Jazz Securo has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee John McCarthy has stepped in and stopped the fight at one minute and 57 seconds of round number one. Officially a TKO due to strikes your winner and still undefeated, Steve Thunderbeast Kuzul!